welcome back to another Maze Plus video. Today we are going to make, have a look if it makes a difference whether you condition the grass or not for yield. And this was prompted by some comments including one from our favourite alien saying that if you, I conditioned the grass when I tested grazing I would have got more. So let's find out. Um, have a new fresh test patch of grass. I went slightly bigger because more yield means less error. Um, and we're going to mow it with a conditioner and collect it into some forage wagons. Or oh, sorry, without a conditioner. So this is unconditioned. We're then going to mow it with the conditioner, collect it in forage wagons and see what happens. So a bit of a time lapse now to get this done. <laughs> So that is almost two forage wagons full of fresh grass off of here. I think these are 50,000 litres forage wagons. So that is 95,688 litres of fresh or unconditioned grass. Let's reload and mow with the conditioner and see what we get then. So let's have a look. Conditioner on. Again, just going to run a work with the mower and I am going to work the forage wagons and we have exactly the same setup and because I saved and reloaded so the field condition is exactly the same it is fully fertilized limed plowed grass um, planted with easy dev tools so it's the same field just now with the conditioner enabled so back into the time lapse Okay, so let's have a look at the results. Um, so you can see that with the unconditioned or fresh grass, we've got 95,888 litres. And with the conditioner enabled, we've got 97,199 litres. So that was a 1.6% gain in yield. Not huge, not maybe worth it. I guess the thing is, if you're using everything as delivered, you could put silage additive in, and that would give you more yield do you really want to I guess yeah if you're cheating enough that you're feeding straight conditioned grass you might just want to put silage additive anyway if you enjoyed the video click the like button leave me comments questions or suggestions below and uh, I'll see you next time